New details on the woman charged with promoting gambling busted during what police say was an illegal game room raid. Ju Hyun Pak was arrested and is now scheduled to be in court on Thursday. KITV 4 Shanila Kabir has this follow up. A 69 year old woman was charged with a felony for possession of an illegal gambling device. She is expected to be seen in court in the next few days. And here at Ohana Grocery, many residents nearby say this crime doesn't really even concern them. They say they don't feel unsafe. I walk past right here every single day, like on my way to school, I take the bus. Um, I didn't, I actually kind of suspected something was going on because recently I've been walking past here and I've been seeing like police officers. For some reason, every time they bust game rooms, they just open right back up. And I don't know, I used to go to game rooms, but I, I stopped going game rooms. Asita says he doesn't mind living right by an illegal game room. He believes a felony charge is too extreme for gambling. The penalty for illegal gambling has recently been upgraded from a misdemeanor to a Class C felony, which means a possible five years in prison. Because it is gambling. And gambling is legal all over the world, but I don't know why it's not legal here. This isn't the first time police have raided Ohana Grocery. In 2020, authorities removed eight gambling machines. Police also conducted a raid there in 2018. When I walk here at night, I feel really unsafe. I, I walk really fast when I walk past here, too. Prosecuting attorney Steve Ahn believes the new law could deter residents from participating in illegal game room activities and even prevent new game rooms from opening. Shanila Kabir, KITV4 Island News.